careful what you wish for. No, this is a good view. <laughs> nah, I, I got what I wish for. I realize I haven't been um recording for a couple minutes. So uh, Arthur, I'm trying to get him out of this place because uh he's he's locked in with that busted door. So I'm trying to get him drunk as much. So at a certain point, he he's not gonna be able to walk around. Come on, keep drinking. Anything? Come on, drink. All this half alcohol. So I'm trying to get him as drunk as possible. So he can basically wander on his own. Come on. Get alcohol poisoning. Oh, shoot. They're... How are they spawning back? I'm getting that drunk. Come on, Arthur. Come on, keep drinking. Keep drinking for Christian. Come on, come on. Keep doing it. I wonder how much alcohol do I need just to, you know, get myself toxicated, you know? I mean, he, he's already finished off the whole entire rum. Oh. Okay. <laughs> he ended up in jail. Oh, wow. Okay. Hey, I kept the hat. Okay, for you guys to... I'm going to keep you guys updated. So, we were doing missions. Um, I was going to head to his wife or his girlfriend, whatever. And I killed the Ozdruskos. Because they were hidden. And I kept the guy's hat. I'm glad I kept the guy's hat. Oh, I also kept our guns. Yeah. Um, they are hard to get, apparently. Their only way to get it is to manage to get back there. I did it, but the door locked on me. So I had to, by force, get Arthur drunk. And I mean, wasted drunk. Hold on. I think he's still alcoholic. I think he needs, uh, where is the piece of meat? There you go. Before we meet our supposedly spouse, I don't think she is. Ah, sorry, boy. All right. All right. Let's meet this chick that I never met before. All right. We love once and true. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Uh, is, um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? A collar for you. Hello, Arthur. Mary? Um, I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's-his-name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... You've been, <clears throat> you've been made a widow, and you come here looking for me. Is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Ah, okay. I, my family. I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? Them? It's my little brother, Jamie. I always liked Jamie, at least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. 
Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Give you the option, but I'm pretty sure the option is going to be limited. Um, I help her, or I don't help her. And it's Please, telling me Arthur. to help her. Arthur alone, I'm I not even touching the button. Ask. Help her, go ahead. So, I'll take that as a yes. Where is it? <laughs> Somewhere out near Carnegie I didn't even Dale, click that button. I think. Clicking it would be the like this. The there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the... I didn't even click the skip button. What the hell? But I ain't gonna take this card, though. What is the card? Show me the card. Dr. Hans... So I don't know how to pronounce the name. All right, all right. I guess we gotta find the boy. I kind of figured there was gonna be a mission within a mission. There's always a mission within a mission. Why? Why can't it just be a simple mission? I see why people got tired of. We're going upstate. Why people got tired of the of the game mission? Retrieve this. Go get that. Get this. I mean, I like I like the game though. Don't get it wrong. I do like the game. Retrieve, retrieve. Go get that. Get this. Go get that. But at the same time, within doing all that, there's a story behind it. And this one does have a story. I mean, you're talking about a a gang that's trying to leave from Blackwater, but they left their money behind. But that's the area that they're supposed to be at because that's where supposedly. Their dream uh, lifestyle was supposed to be at. But now they're. Instead of heading east, they're heading west. And they don't want to head west. Because that's where society. It's, in, in other words, they want to head to Texas instead of New York. Let's make it simpler for you guys to understand it. Oh, what? Oh, hey, you there! Think you could help a lady out? My horse up and died on me, twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? A mission within a mission. Fine. You robbed me, I'm shooting yeah, you. Sure. I'm saying uh -huh. it right now. You robbed me, I'm oh, shooting thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You know Emerald Ranch? Mind taking me there? Yep. All right. Sure. Glad I ran into you. I'm huh. glad I ran into you. I raised you. that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. <laughs> that fool. Always complaining, but does he do something about it? Nah. Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away. Aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. I mean, but Biscuit, there's ups and downs. He was a fine animal. Loyal, smart. Brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off. But I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise. Because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. God damn, well that is a horse bite to be honest. Horses away. can do that. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? 
should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <coughs> so, you live at Emerald Ranch then? For yeah. the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. Hmm. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, oh. too. The likes in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there, all shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Oh, we're getting close now. I know, kid. Time travels really, really quick, you know. But she was saying something about bullet holes, yeah. old. I'm guessing that's the old whiskey place. It looks run down. They all look alike. I ain't gonna lie. Here we go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please take this as my way of thanking you. Alright. <clears throat> Appreciate it. <sighs> what a lousy day. But like I was saying, a mission within a mission. For God some reason. Alright, so we gotta go... I feel like we're going up the mountain. On the direction we're heading towards, we're going... North. Northwest, let's see. Or west-north, basically. That is close up the mountain. If we do go up the mountain, I would have to deal... With a lot. Because I don't think the horse is able to... Well, maybe this horse can. I was thinking of the other tiny one. And it looks like it wants to rain, but it doesn't rain. I'm surprised that they, they allowed me to keep the hat on. I mean... I haven't showed it to the, to the crew, but I wonder what the crews would think of me wearing a Driscoll hat. Careful. We are in the mountain area now. I wonder avalanche ever happened in here. I mean, I see a bunch of rocks, but who knows that avalanche could happen. Oh, we're close. I guess we are going up the mountain. Alright, alright, alright. So we gotta go up there so Calmly and stuff. And what is Chelonianism? No less than the recent rediscovery of the Oxford. <laughs> One hundred years ago, the great Chelonian master. What are they talking about? Across the Lanahassee into the wilderness. Gentlemen! Shell of safety. 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 Shell of Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. Why is he looking down? The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. He hasn't given. He haven't what given him eye to eye contact chosen, at all. Sir. He's looking down throughout the whole entire time. And. So, do you have an answer? I don't know about this nonsense. Let me speak to the boy. Dut, dut. Are you always this negative and antagonistic, sir? I guess I apologize. 
I'm not a very cultured man. Forgive me, please. <laughs> I am a fool for my god and a happy one, sir. I bless you. He is a religious type, though. What do I dream about? Who are my heroes? Oh, that's why he's acting like that. Hold on. Hold on. I just realized he's... Turtle? I have no idea. Um, turtles. Yeah, turtles. Hey, you love turtles. I love them too. Turtles. Turtles. Um. <laughs> Jamie knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm... Don't I'm jump, not... kid. I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary, then make up your mind! She Leave me you. alone, Arthur! Oh, okay. But I realized why he was looking down. He's hungry. Arthur's hungry. He's sick. Imagine going downhill doing a sharp turn. This horse can't do that sharp turn. Come on, Jamie, your sister's worried about you. Come on, boy. Son of a gun. You son of a gun. They're just using you. Telling you what you want to hear. Come on, horse. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I know you're hurt, but I'll fix you in a bit. And I lost him. Son of a gun. All because of that freaking cabin little thing went down. <clears throat> Alright, we gotta go back for Jamie. I hope I don't have to impress the the turtles. Leave me alone, Arthur! I didn't ask for your help! Oh, okay, he's so sick though. Let's not forget. Where's the where's the meat? Where's the meat? I need the meat. There you go. There you go. So I'm guessing that carriage is by yep, that carriage by force is in that scene. So that means by force I gotta serve it or take the actual route. Does go down there. They're just using you, telling you what you want to hear. What the hell do you know about it, Arthur? Son of a gun, horse! How are you tripping over so many things? Come on, bud. Morning to you. Yeah, hey, yeah. Morning to you too. Do I just shoot his horse? I don't want to shoot the horse, but do I just shoot the horse? <laughs> Come on. Alright, Arthur, you're gonna, you're gonna need to hold it on eating, cause Jamie here and just thinks that running away solves all his problems. I don't have to answer to you. I don't have to answer to you. Yeah, get in front of that go kart. Just using you. They are actually Tell using you. What, you wanna hear. what the hell do you know about it, Arthur? For Christ's sakes, Jamie, just hold up a minute. You pop up out of nowhere? I think I can catch him now. Yeah. Come on, Jamie, your sister's worried about you. I was doing just fine by myself. Come on, come on, can I catch him? Come on, you ain't stupid, you can see this is crazy. You're the crazy one. Come on. I think I can catch Stop. him. Stop, let's talk about this. This is none of your damn business. Yeah, 
This is why you're not supposed to have kids in the 1800s. This is actually in the 1800s. What are you gonna do, Jamie? 18, I think 1889 or 1898. If you don't leave me alone, I'll shoot you. I swear it. Okay, do it. You talking about? You ain't no killer. You don't know who I am. He missed twice. You know what's Please, stupid? Arthur, I'm a man now. I, I found something. A calling. You're just a kid. You're making a big mistake. I'm not taking advice from you. You're an outlaw. You leave me alone. They're good people. I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan. And you're ho you should have just ran with the leave horse instead of looking back. This kid, Please, he is an idiot. Kid. He is a kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Come on. Now calm down. Let's go see your sister. Okay. He is a kid. Okay. <sighs> okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. That is Are true. you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. There's never shame for a better world. That is a true statement. Oh, Hold on. This... I'm trying to look for a faster route. I can take the railroad track. Head right back home. Yep. Let's take the railroad track. It wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. you didn't try to kill yourself. You know... You taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Shalonia, though? Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtles. Shut up. All father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father, a nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. The thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, uh, well, um... Don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. He is a kid. But the real question is, how old is he? Like the same height as Arthur, maybe like in his 18s, 16s. You got a problem? All right, let's hitch up the horse. You're nervous about seeing her, aren't you? I'm guessing that's her reading a book. Hopefully. Yep. Jamie! Jamie! Come home. Please. You've... Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. 
But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. He likes turtles. <laughs> but it was real watching. Oh wait, how is that train moving? feel like hmm. the luckiest man alive and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. Hey, now partner, we don't want any more trouble from you, okay? Alrighty guys, so I'm gonna end it off there guys. What we know of, she's a bad sister for letting him run off with a crew who likes turtles and use up his money. Honestly, any charity that evolves with money, I don't trust okay, it. Boy. Oh, overall, it's just, it's, it's just a thing that okay, everything boy. evolves with money now. Makes no sense. But yeah. Uh, I'm gonna just end it up there, guys. Uh, next game, video, me, seconds, you, days. Uh, <laughs> I'll be doing the final mission. Hopefully, it's a final mission, but it's gonna be the final mission. Picking up him. And let's see. Hopefully, it's the end of chapter two. Hopefully. I mean, yeah.